That's not a good sign. No fault on the vendor. Yep, not fragile. One, two. Awesome. And three. This was all about number three. What do we got? Whoa. Uh, looks like a Linemar space tank. No, it's different. There's the Linemar tank along with a box unit. And as you can see, the post hole for the radar dish is directly behind the cab. On this one, it's off to the side. It's also a smaller vehicle than the Linemar tank. And there's none of the red paint along the sides. Dome canopy design is completely different. It's not the same thing. It's an unknown Japanese-made miniature die-cast space tank. It's a gorgeous, cool little form. And that's something that will look great in one of those 4x4 four four inch boxes. Number two is a heliocopter. This looks like the uh, bag of best toy. Japan uh, Piyaseki HUP. No, it's different. Behind is the bag of best toy Piyaseki HUP with a more complex canopy design. The new one is also shorter length, very different paint scheme, different side scheme. I've had a rotten cold, which is the only excuse I can say for myself for not spotting it immediately, but it's a very different animal than the bag of best toy Piyaseki. From the different shape of the canopy, I'm also wondering if it might be a Boeing Verton Chinook, although I may be wrong. I've been wrong before, and I'll be wrong again. <laughs> and the vendor had specified that in the listing. It's missing one rotor blade off of each side, but that's not a problem, especially if it gets glued into an artwork with those two, with, with that side against whatever. Does it even need the rotors on it? We're going to leave them there. Um, I could also try painting it because it's it's less than perfect. Um, but I'm pleased to have that. And then the, the number three was the one that I really wanted. What the heck is that? That's a that's a space tank or something with the uh, wrecker space wrecker. To pull the wreckage off of the moon base landing pad after mishap. That thing rules. And it was a bargain scoring it. I've never seen it. I'm not sure who made it. It, it doesn't look like... I mean, I'm not familiar, I guess, with the Linemar Elegant Miniatures line enough to say that that's not by Marks. Not by Linemar. It's got a Japan... Right there against the front bow. What's going on over here? Nothing. Nothing on that side. And I didn't see anything on the bottom as far as markings. So it's a, a mysterious made in Japan space tank with Riker hook. Dude, that's a score. And the other two are, are, are knickknacks that can go into artworks. I mean, that could as well. I think I'm going to keep it as a photographic subject more than that because it's just too cool. No, that's not going into an artwork. Those two can, and I, I've already thought maybe I could paint the tank a different color, find something to go in the post hole there in the back, maybe the helicopter too. Dude, this rules. Awesome stuff. Art supplies. These are art supplies. They're not just frivolous toys that a man in his 50s are, is buying to get some sort of cheap chuckle. Right on. We'll show you what we do with them. Over and out. Miles and miles.